Finish off last night's debate, President Biden will be in New York today. The president will mark the 55th anniversary of the Stonewall riots at the opening of the new Stonewall National Monument Visitor Center. CBS News Shosh Bedrosian is live in the Flatiron District along the route of Sunday's Pride March. Shosh. Good morning. We are marking the end of Pride Month and celebrity advocates and politicians will be coming together for the first time at this brand new visiting center to honor the LGBTQ plus movement and its fight for equality. Now, this is the first time a visiting center like this is being recognized by the National Park Service. And this brand new center is 2100 square feet on Christopher Street, which will serve as an educational resource and offer an immersive experience about the LGBTQ plus history through different kinds of programming. Founders of the center say the experience will encourage people to carry forward the Stonewall legacy and the ongoing fight for LGBTQ plus equality. Today marks 55 years since the Stonewall uprising, which was the beginning of a series of events between police and LGBTQ plus protesters for six days. The events of that week would spearhead LGBTQ plus activism in the United States. Now, for the whole month of June, New York City honors and celebrates pride through a series of events. NYC Pride says the events are inspired to work towards a future without discrimination where all people have equal rights under the law. Now, the annual NYC Pride March will be this Sunday, June 30th, which originally started back in 1970, just one year after the Stonewall Uprising. Now, the Pride March will take place right here along Fifth Avenue. For a full list of Pride events, you can head to our website. As for the visiting center, it is officially open for the public starting today and is free of charge. We're in Midtown. I'm Shosh Bedrosian, CBS 2 News.